Good afternoon, kids. Um, it's good to see everyone back online. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. It is hot outside. Make sure you guys are drinking plenty of water. Um, if you get a chance to swim in a pool or uh, play some water games with some friends, I hope you guys get to do that. I am going to share one verse with you today, and it's a simple truth, but I think it's something you should remember um, as the Lord continues to grow you and uh, give you gifts and talents, okay? And it's found in 1 Peter chapter 4, verse number 10. And it says, As every man hath received the gift, even so minister the same one to another, as good stewards of the manifold grace of God. And kids, let me tell you something, okay? God created you in a very, very special way. And in fact, there is nobody on the planet like you. You are very unique and God has designed you in His perfect way. Now, the other thing is, He designed you with some gifts. Now, you guys have seen all these uh, superhero movies. You got Spider-Man, you have the Avengers, and, and you know any other new movies that are coming out. You see all of these superhero characters with each having a special ability. Well, now I'm not saying you guys are going to have special ability, abilities and powers, but God does give you gifts. And uh, there's the gift of uh, teaching and loving and encouraging or um, giving. And there's other ones listed throughout the Bible. But as you continue to get older, God is going to reveal to you some of the gifts that you have. Now, I want you to know that gifts are just uh, given to you not just so they can be thrown out. Okay, God has given you a gift so that you can use that to point others to a creator who is very, very good. And, uh, you know, some of you guys, some of you guys maybe are athletic, some of you guys are really, really smart, some of you guys got some brains, and it's like, man, they are much smarter than Pastor Sherwin. Well, what does the Bible tell us? To use these gifts so that we can glorify our Father and that we can encourage other people. And it's not just so we can make ourselves look good, that's the temptation. If we have a gift, it's not for us like, well, look at me. I'm just, uh, I am the children's pastor. That would be wrong. That's called pride. But God says, I've given you a gift. I've given a gift to Pastor Sherwin. Who knows? Maybe just, it's the attitude I have to work with kids. But I'm going to use that gift so I can point others to Jesus. And I want to encourage you and challenge you. As you get older, you're going to start seeing some of these cool gifts that God gives you. And man, I am excited to see them too. But I want you to remember to use those gifts so that you can point people to Jesus. Okay? Now, you guys are doing great. Stay with me for these next couple days and throughout the weeks. We don't know what's going to happen the next couple weeks. But stay tuned. And uh, I am praying for you guys. I pray that you guys will stay safe and that uh, you guys will enjoy your summer. If you're taking vacation... Enjoy your vacation, make lots of memories, and have some fun, okay? You guys have a wonderful day, and we will see you guys online next time.